Hey, how's it going? In this video, I'm creating an Instagram meme page. The idea behind this is that I build up a following on Instagram and I could potentially sell like sponsorship for the niche I am posting about. I don't want to do this work myself because it's long winded and I'm not particularly kind of interested in the kind of curation. So I'm going to automate the whole lot. So I'm using Make, uh, you could use Integromat, it will do exactly the same thing. So go to make.com, sign up, I've got a link below this video somewhere, and you'll need the watch module. And what I'm doing here is I'm watching a particular Instagram account, and then I'm going to take the image, I'm going to use um, DaVinci or OpenAI's um, ChatGPT003, um, and I'm going to ask it to write a quick question about skateboarding and then I'm going to grab the image, grab the caption, and I'm going to post it to my Instagram. So I'm basically stealing other people's content, but credited them for the meme page. So the page will look like this. You can see here where I've been testing. So I'm currently monitoring Nike's skateboarding um, page, and then I'm grabbing the image. I'm writing a caption about skateboarding, and I'm posting it to my own page. So I'll test this out, and I'll show you the setup. So we can see here, we've got my page set up, it's called SkateUp. Um, the username I'm watching is Nike SB. We can change that to whatever we like. So I'm gonna change this just for um, this search here. So let's have a look at the skateboards and see what we can find. Let's find something that looks like it's actually gonna be posting useful stuff. Who's this guy? Is he a skater? Yeah, possibly. Let's grab this guy's handle. And I'm going to put it under here. Just double check that's right. So, yep, that's correct. And so I'm going to watch his post. You can do a limit of whatever amount. So I'm going to watch this every time he posts a new picture. I'm going to take it. I'm going to rewrite the caption and I'm going to post it on my Instagram. But I'm going to credit him, you know. It's, um, I'm not going to steal his content and claim it's mine. So I've got that set up. Now, we need the module called OpenAI um, DAL E GPT, and we are creating a prompt completion. What this means in English is that OpenAI is an AI model. A prompt is telling it to do something, and the model we are using is DaVinci 003. So you'll need an account with OpenAI, so go and create one of them, and then you just log in and you authenticate yourself, and then it will work. So we need to create a prompt. DaVinci 003, there's loads of on models we can use. You can see all of them down here. But we want 3.5 and DaVinci 003. And then we need the prompt. You can get as sophisticated as you like for this, but for this tutorial, I am just going to write something very easy just to get a response back. So write a short question about uh, skateboarding, not skateboarding. And then what I'm doing is I've got another Instagram and I'm creating a post. The media URL is taken from here. So what it's doing is watching Instagram, it's grabbing the URL, it's pasting it into here, and then the caption is the response from the OpenAI prompt. So it's taking the output, it's pasting it into here. I've got my photo credit set up. I'm grabbing the username through the image I have taken, and then I'm posting my hashtags. So if a whole lot together, will run a little bit like this. Let's just see if it will run. I might have to tinker with it just to get it to run. Sometimes makes a bit temperamental. So we've got an image. We've just rewritten the caption. Let's have a look what it's doing. See what, um, how can I learn to do an ollie on a skateboard? I mean, there's a question about skateboarding. Got to give it um, to that. And if we go back to my page and we refresh, here we go. Weirdly enough, he is uh, doing a form of Ollie. And so it's taken us here. So it's pasted in the caption, credit to um, this guy here. And then it's got my hashtags. We've already got one like, which is most likely a bot. One thing I do need to improve is adding a at. So it actually turns it into a full credit. So if we go to here and we want to add in the at symbol, make sure we've got no spaces between the username and the actual at. So now if we run it again, 
This is what annoys me about Make. Sometimes it runs flawlessly, and other times it just kind of hiccups and just grabs one image. So if we choose where to start, and then we'll just choose a manual one for now. Um, let's try this one here. And we'll run it. There we go. It's going to rewrite the caption. And let's have a look. Hopefully, the credit for the handle will also be... Yeah, here we go. So it's now linked to the guy's Instagram correctly. So full credit is going to him. Um, I'm not taking any credit for his pictures. But what you can do now is you could set up, I don't know, 20 of these modules, um, all duplicates of this template, but change the handle for the username you are watching. So you could have like Nike Skateboarding, a Tony Hawk, all of the skaters, like 20 of them. Every time they post, you grab their content, you write a cool little caption, you add some hashtags, and then you repost it to your account here. Before you know it, your page will be absolutely full of the niche that you are reposting. Could be a cool little use case. Perhaps you can make some money from it if you grow your page big enough, start then sponsoring brands with stories and things like that. Um, yeah, bit of a fun little project. Takes 10 minutes to make. Um, yeah, enjoy. If you like this kind of content, drop me a follow, subscribe, leave a comment below. All of that will be really appreciated. Anyway, nice one. See ya.